Okay, here is our last lesson for the week. This is Friday, May 29th. Um, I found a really interesting article on ReadWorks. Um, this one's called Reducing the Impact of Flooding. And um, definitely with the spring rains across the country, we are, um, are lots, of, lots of places in the country are having um, some flooding problems. So I just thought this was a really interesting article to talk a little bit about um, the cause and effect of flooding in different areas and solutions to what we can do to prevent um, uh, the problem of flooding. So your job is to go ahead and read the article. There's just a very short article, two pages. At the back side here. So you've got two little um, charts to complete. The first one is the cause of it all. So the cause on this side, boys and girls, um, definitely is going to be, so we've got flooding. What is the effect that flooding can have on communities and the environment? So when you're going back, there's, there's going to be more than one. So I would say for your cause, okay, the flooding, and then your effect. I want you to add maybe two to three different effects of what flooding can do to the environment, okay? And then on the back side, kind of going back to what we learned last week about problem and solution, and when you're reading informative text, um, how to go back and figure out what is the problem of the article and what are some solutions to help with that problem. Okay, so you're going to be able to do both of these with the same text. Okay, so you've got reducing the impact of flooding. Go ahead and read that. And you've got your two charts here to show me what you've learned from the article. Okay, all right, have a great week.